Hi, welcome to the new blog. But before that, I just want to pass on some news which I'm sure is going to be disappointing to anyone going to Comic-Con this year, any fans, that a couple of days ago I told Warners that I just really wasn't ready to present anything of the desolation of Schmaug at Comic-Con this year. The reasons for that are, well, there's several, really. Um, we're still shooting, and we're going to be shooting through the period of Comic-Con. So we looked at what actors we could send, you know, to make a really cool panel. Um, there wasn't really anybody available. I can't go. So faced with that, the prospect was then, you know, record some messages, have a really cool sizzle reel. But, you know, the problem is I'm so busy shooting, uh, working six days a week trying to get these pickups done, that every hour that I spend focusing on a really great reel for Comic-Con, and it would have to be great, would be hours spent away from the vital job of uh, making the second and third Hobbit films as cool as they can possibly be. I mean, this is the last ditch shooting that we're doing, and it's going fantastic, and these are going to be great movies. And, and, and I just had to take the, the Comic-Con burden, if you like, off my shoulders, because I'm very, very hands-on on those reels, as I should. I want, to, I want them to be fantastic, and I really didn't want to um, send anything this year that was going to be less than fantastic. So I'm sure you'll understand. Um, we're going to jump back into it and keep shooting, doing everything we can to make sure these next two films are fantastic, and they're going to be great. And I'm sure you'll see more of the movie as the year goes on at just nothing at Comic-Con this year. But the good news part of this is that we have a new video blog. So um, let's roll that. Thank you. Gandalf, if what you say is true, the world is in grave danger. Excellent. Our new <laughs> blog is sweeping in from the north. <laughs> 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 Hello, welcome to the first blog of 2013. And this is a block of a few weeks of shooting we're doing. It's what we call pickup shooting. Yo, we're back, look out. We rebuild the unit base, we re rebuild the trailer park here at Stone Street. Putting the jigsaw back together for us, literally. Um, brought in all the makeup, costume, prosthetics vehicles. Crews arriving. Everybody's happy about being back again. Oh, hello. Hi. Boys are amped, pumped. Looking forward to it. Fire it up. Get amongst it. Shoot it. We're just going to shoot it. When we finished principal photography last year, we stored all the sets in huge big warehouses. All the costumes, the cast uh, are all flying back into New Zealand. It's a reunion of people, props, and sets. We are very much in full swing. We're bringing Lake Town back. We're bringing Mirkwood Forest back. We'll be revisiting Dale. It's been covered up for a year. We're just pulling off all the coverings right now. We knew it was going to be pretty hectic, pretty fast. And uh, true to form, it is. I can't actually see the plans because I left my spectacles at home. So I've got Dave the Punk here, who's Ahoy. going to be my eyes. I actually know how to use a scale ruler, so this should be interesting. For our props and set deck, it's finding all the props. We have warehouses full of props. This is an off-site prop store that we've put together for Film 2. Over here we've got the contents of the Dale Armoury. There are over 2,000 items made specific for that one scene. This, of course, is the kitchen. Our kitchen is shared with some corpses. Every space is valuable when you're talking about prop storage. OK, here we are again. We're actually waiting for the actors to come in on mass all together for the first time. So it's really going to be good to see them all together after about six, seven months. Hugs and kisses. I'm really looking to do some fighting. Here we go again. Yes. All right. Yes. Yeah. Good to be back. Apart from with these two. <laughs> marvellous. Thanks. See, that's marvellous. That's, 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 I mean, it is good to be back, but that's technically I would rather be back with somebody else other than these two. Son of a bitch. <laughs> it's Groundhog Day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and it's all good. I mean, that was fun. That's a weird mix of Break some of Rectite. Three, two, one, eight. That was really adequate, man. <laughs> Lovely move. <laughs> Golf clap. I mean, no, big clap. <laughs> they all hate my guts. Hate my guts. Really, really hate it. <laughs>
Of course, we've also got the Battle of the Five Armies, which is for the third Hobbit movie. In fact, while we're talking about the Battle of the Five Armies, we obviously can't show you any of that. However, we are putting our dwarves through a very extensive training regime. They have to be fighting fit for that battle, and so they're, um, they're working very hard at the moment. OK, so in preparation for the Battle of Five Armies, all of us dwarves have been doing some rigorous training, and uh, you've caught us just as we're about to start one. And up, down, up, down, up, pump! Come on, pump him side! Fire, pump him, pump him! A little bit of running now. Woo! You're right, that's great. We're a fit fighting machine. And to give you a sense of what pickups are, we shot about 18 months ago down at the Pelorus River in the South Island. Now that would get you killed. We were filming and then we got flooded out by a, a flash storm. So here we are 18 months later in the relative safety, hopefully, of the back lot. The weather's not looking too bad. Hopefully we're not going to get a flood through here. And we're just doing a little bit more shooting for the scene on the riverbank. You're from Lake Town, if I'm not mistaken. It will look exactly the same, I promise you, when you see it in the movie. Exactly the same. Pickups, what does it mean? It means getting your poo exactly the same. We are having to do pickups with Radagast, and we have to make sure that his poo looks like it did a year ago. And that's sometimes difficult because we all know poo changes and it dries out and it cracks. And so now we've got to replace the poo and make it look exactly the same. People actually do collect my poo. <laughs> it's on sale at a shop near you. <laughs> no, it's not. The number's not working. Oh, man. That's like the third one this morning. For the pickups, uh, we need lots of people. And <laughs> I've been ringing trying to get people. I've changed their numbers. They've moved. What is that? I'm trying to find elves. Oh. And of the 30 elves that we've had, I have about two that have confirmed so far. One of them's in the London Ballet now, and the other one has put on uh, 40 pounds. Oh, no. That's no, selfish. You know, I'm over it. <laughs> no! Oh my god, I've got a whole lot of people to ring, and now there's a fire alarm. <laughs> Little yearly drill, look at their happy, smiley faces. <laughs> There's some great faces in the crew. Good Lake Towners. Yeah, really good Lake Towners. Not very many elves. Still making bird poo. Because the, the pickup scenes are really spanning the width of the second and third Hobbit movie, we're really travelling to most of the destinations that those films do. Thank you for being here again in the webs. It's like you never left. You've got well, the, same, it is a bit like that, the same smells. Yeah. The same fungus is growing inside your bloody costume. It's weird how comfortable it all just feels. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, uh huh. <laughs> so, that's the last date we have. Okay? Go to a movie, he said. You go down on the beach, but no. I wake up, I'm covered in this stuff. <laughs> Not only that, those are all the X's over there. <laughs> Greenleaf. And you? Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Welcome to the film. <laughs> We're shooting right now in the Smaug Desolated Dale, therefore the title of the film, The Desolation of Smaug. I was here last year when this set was in its full glory and looked incredible, looked like a beautiful European plaza. Now it's winter and there's snow everywhere and it's really dramatic. <gasps> I popped my cherry on the fake horse today. Having Evie on the back, and then the first time they had this set up. So she's behind me. But we were both <laughs> moving in rhythm, and she's behind me, and it's like. We've been shooting for a week or so now, so we've got a little bit of footage from the first week, which we'll put into this blog, and uh, the plan is to do another blog at the end of the pickup shooting, so we can bring you up to speed with whatever's going to happen over the next few weeks. Bard Marley of Lake Town. We're back in Lake Town. This is yep. the fifth version of this town that's been built for the movie, and we're here to do pickups, right? Pickups for 10 weeks. I played this character for a whole year in this environment and not once did I fall in the water. 
what happened on my first day back. But as you can see, this man has grown. Because this is his normal size. But in the film, he will be this size. Which is appropriate, because he's my son. We hope that you come and check in with us in the next few months when we'll be uh, showing you a little bit more of Hobbit and the amazing sets and uh, locations we're working on. I can't wait to get Just don't grow anymore, please. Don't grow anymore. I can't promise that. This is ridiculous now. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Thanks for watching.